Welcome to Vloggers episode 21, but first of all, got to ask a security guard because I'm well lost. Excuse me, buddy. I'm trying to, I've got a reservation at Ohana's and I'm lost. I don't know how to get to there. I've got 20 minutes to get there. No, so there is a walkway right here. You just follow the water all the way around. You'll see the wedding pavilion. Once you get to the wedding pavilion, stay to your left. That'll take you on the pathway to the Polynesian and then it'll lead you right into the main building. Then. Just down here then? Yes, sir. Cheers, buddy. Thank you. No Bye. That's the Grand Floridian. And here's the Grand Floridian. Ah, this is what I've been looking for. This pathway. Right, I can start reading your story now. It's 21st of December. Right, everyone should be well geared up for Christmas now. Here's one of the boats taking people back. There's a splash port at the Grand Floridian. How long have I got till dinner? Oh, we're cutting this fine. All right, here we go. Mater saves Christmas from cars. One, one morning, Mater arrived at Flo's V8 Cafe with his letter to Father Karmus. All the townspeople had written one. Oh, they'd all written a letter. Oh, right, Father Karmus is Father Christmas. Right, we've got that, I'm getting stuck already. We're only on the full flight. Just as Mater, just as Mater was drop, just as Mater was dropping his letter in the post box, Chick Hicks, one of Lightning's rivals showed up. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. I better not do that too much. If I put the light in my eyes, I can't see where I'm going. I'm gonna fall over the edge of there. He began to tease Mater, saying that Santa car didn't exist. Well, of course he exists. Just then, Sheriff raced up to them with some bad news. All the fuel from the area had been stolen. Sounds like real. The townspeople were shocked. Without fuel, the post fans couldn't deliver letters to, watch where you're going, to Santa Car. But Mater wouldn't give up. He decided to deliver the letters to the North Pole himself. That was a lot like the fuel shortage in the Southeast recently, wasn't it? No petrol, nothing works. Lightning was worried about his friend. He couldn't let him go alone. Mater, I'm coming with you, he said. I better be quiet, I forgot how loud I am. People, there are gonna be kids in bed. Ah, well, carry on. Lightning was worried about his friend. He couldn't let him go alone. Mater, I'm coming with you, he said. Luigi and Guido gave Mater and Lightning new snow tires and the two set off. Oh, there they are. The green one, the green one, the red one, and Mater. Oh, I can see them all now. Now it makes sense. Now it makes sense. Finally, Lightning and Mater arrived at the North Pole. Didn't the Grand Floridian look pretty? Oh. I'm gonna be the sweatiest person in Ohana's, I can guarantee you that. Especially with this itchy out. It's so itchy. Finally, Lightning and Mater arrived at North Pole. Lightning stared at, in wonder. Santa Car is real, he said. But Santa Car has some bad news. <laughs> His reindeer snowmobiles have been stolen. It is real. Just then, Mater remembered how strangely Chick had been acting. He realized that Chick wanted the top selling flying fuel the reindeer used. Ah, oh, right, like super fuel, like nitro. That's what he wants, nitrous oxide. Chick Hicks took your reindeer, he cried. So Chick, Hick, Chick Hicks nicked the reindeer. I hope I'm going the right way. This is the wedding chapel. Have we got time to have a quick nosy? We've got five minutes spare. I'm guessing we've got five minutes spare. I've got no idea because I don't know how long it takes to get where we're going because I've already got lost four times. 
but we'll keep going. The Polynesians. Oh, well done. I was just about to go off in that direction. We, did it. we already did that, so just go this way. Oh, there's a couple of lovely American ladies helping me out here. <laughs> Thank you. I'm trying to read Christmas stories. Oh, carry on. In a very. They're not very good. Oh, there's restrooms at the wedding chapel. Well, there's got to be really, isn't there? You don't know how long. What happens if she gets stood up? What happens if he stands her up or she stands his? You've got to have to go. Some people just can't hold it on. Right, here we go. Center car filled meters tank with the top secret fuel and the three cars set out for radiator springs. Back in town, I've got, I can't see where I'm going again. Back in town, Luigi and Gildo, Guido, had been cornered by Chick and his gang. Oh. I hope he gives him a good idea. Right. Ha! You're too late, boys, Chick shouted. I'll fly around the track and never lose to Lightning McQueen again. And you know the best part? No more Christmas. If I can't have presents, no one can. Someone who's spoilt. Suddenly, the air filled the sound of jingling bells. Mate, a sword over the hill, towing Lightning and Santa car. Chick raced. I nearly walked into something. Chick raced away, flying just above the ground. Lightning flew after him. Santa car had filled his tank with the magic fuel too. Chick was no match for Lightning McQueen. The thief soon spun out of control. Tow him straight to jail, said Doc. What, no trial, nothing? Just straight to prison? It's not very fair, is it? Later, the Radiator Springs gang celebrated with Santa car and his reindeer snowmobiles, everyone cheered. Mater had saved Christmas. So what happened in that story was there was a fuel shortage and then someone had nicked all the fuel and then they locked somebody up without a fair trial. It's not very Christmassy from a Disney book, that is it? But there we go, that's episode 21 on the 21st of December. Thanks for watching, I'll catch you tomorrow. Later. Oh. Stupid, itchy wig off. Ah, I'm still recording. Ah, they've taken me out off. We're nearly at the Polynesian. And I'm definitely late for dinner. But it's my own fault. I don't know if you can see that. Contemporary. It's very pretty. You've got the Magic Kingdom there where I'm pointing there. And the distance. I'll zoom it in in the edit. And then you've got the Contemporary there. And the Polynesian. And I'm Steve. Oh, hang on then. I better put me out on. If I'm going to finish it, let's finish it properly. Put the effort in aid. Right. So, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if anybody's still watching this. This was a car crash of a. Car crash of a story, really. Well, it was a, it was a car story. I got completely confused by what was going on. They, all I understood, there was a petrol shortage. Hang on, have I got to go across there? I don't know. I'm glad there's a fence there. So no big alligator comes up and bites me on the leg. Oh. Ah.